Hello and welcome to Pro Poker Hots for Holiday Manager 2. In this short video, I will show you how to install and set up your Pro Poker Hots for Holiday Manager 2. Right? First of all, you will need a valid license of Holiday Manager 2 and Note Caddy Premium. You can click here on the links and download the software. And after you are ready with Holiday Manager and Note Caddy, can click on start my free trial or buy now scroll down and here all you have to do is to insert your hobby manager to license code and your email address and select if you want the free trial or the high stakes uh, with no buying restrictions then you click on purchase and a few minutes later you will be getting an email with the installation with the installation instructions and the download link all right so the holy manager to license code where do i get that okay in note caddy um, inside holy manager all you have to do is to go to note caddy run note caddy then click on help and about note caddy if you click here you will get the code and you copy the code right here okay then when you receive the email with the installation instructions you'll also find the link the download link you can go ahead and download the zip file and follow the installations okay now um, let's close the holy manager just to start from the very beginning so you can go ahead and Run Holy Manager 2. Mm. Then inside Holy Manager 2, go to Note Caddy and you wait a little bit because it's going to be loading. When it says ready, you can go ahead and click on Run Note Caddy. Now, um, many times when you click on Run Note Caddy after uh, getting the email, you'll be prompt by Notecaddy if you want to automatically install the coaching pack. All right, um, you will get a message something like this. So you have updates available, or it will tell you that you get uh, the new coaching package. So when you get this kind of um, prompt by Notecaddy, um, it's okay to click to click on yes, um, but we do recommend clicking on no and I'll show you why now. So you click on no and after you run no caddy, let's see if we get the prompt. We might not get it because this is not the first time we have been um, importing the coaching pack in this computer. So you might not get the message right now. Okay, so we don't get it and it's fine. So what you will see here, uh, if this is the first time you're starting Note Caddy with the coaching package, is going to be this uh, starting screen. So, first step, if you click on No, is coming here, and in the No Definition section, you will need to disactivate, okay? Make inactive all the No Definitions that you're not going to be needing any longer. Uh, in this case, we're going to disactivate or inact make inactive the custom ones that come with note caddy so we select on the first one and scroll down then you can press and hold the shift key click on the last one to select them all right click to make them inactive okay so we make the note definitions inactive and we're going to do the same with the color definitions click on the first one shift click the last one right click make inactive Okay, now that we have all the node definitions and the color definitions inactive, we can go to um, File, Settings, and in the settings, what we have to do is to set up the um, recommended settings. The recommended settings, um, you will get um, a PDF file or a link right here so you can click when you get the installation instructions you can click on configure note caddy settings click right here and you'll get 
the PDF document with all the recommended settings right so you have to make sure that you change all the settings all the different tabs and save the changes when you have done that all you have to do is to um, come here and in tools import select import coaching package so this is step the import coaching package you don't have to do it if you uh, click on yes when locally prompt you for automatically downloading the package right or installing the package but we do recommend clicking on no because you can come here first make the old no definitions inactive and also set up the settings right the recommended settings so we want we're going to import the coaching package um, just go to your desktop or wherever you um, save it select it open it and once this coaching pack is successfully imported your notes will be reset and regenerated yeah this may take some time click on yes um, would you like to reset the notes yes and the notes that not carry has added have been removed so we remove the old notes and when we when you choose to create notes again it will generate them from all the hands on your database it's fine click on ok and now your code note carry coaching package has been successfully imported your notes are now being recreated okay click on accept and automatically note carry is going to start to create and save the notes this might take some time depending on the size of your database right now you can see here on the right that all the node definitions the pro poker hot node definitions are going to be showing up here it's same as the color definitions okay you can go ahead and click on any one of the node definitions right click and we can choose open the containing folder right we get the containing folder and we can click back to get to the holding manager root folder and here we're going to choose the auto rate rules folder okay auto rate rules folder um, now you can wait until holding manager stops creating the nodes or you can actually um, yeah the better is to stop uh, to wait to for hold the manager no carry to stop and then when it stops you can close hold the manager and when you close hold the manager you can come you can go to the desktop and in the desktop you're going to find a folder like this one named note carry coaching pack files so we can open up this folder and select and copy the auto write rules and we're going to paste the rules in the folder we just opened in the note carry root folders okay just copy and replace yes copy and replace select there yes and next step is going to be here in holding manager you can go to home right wait a little bit it's gonna be a little bit um, longer than usual because it's working a lot in your database right now and we are going to click on hot settings and we're going to import the hot so go to desktop choose the node carry coaching pack uh, files folder that was created after you imported the coaching package and select the elite mtt hot or the advanced hub 
depending on your case and this opportunity we're going to select the elite one click on open and the software will ask you if you want to override the pop-ups this is fine all the pop-ups are going to be new in the system so just click on yes every time yes 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 Okay, and now your Elite Entity HUD has been successfully imported in NodeCaddy. Okay, now we have to make sure to select in this section, the HUD Designer section, to uh, show NodeCaddy notes and click on Start Caddy Report on HUD Launch. This is recommended you can go to the installation instructions and also click on configure hot settings you'll get to see the PDF file and in this file we are going to set up the settings in the same way they are explained in the file uh, go to general settings set it up in that way and all the different tabs same with the hot filters and after we have done this you can click on apply to save the changes okay and then when node cali finishes adding all the nodes to your database you can close Holmeyer restart it and then you will be ready to start using your node caddy uh, your prop pocket hots with node caddy and holding manager too so this is going to be pretty much the whole process and well welcome to prop pocket hots have a great day thanks